What's up, Pocket Nation? This is Scotty Pockets, and we're back for another State of the Address, and this is the 2024 version. So I want to wish you guys a happy holiday. Hopefully your Christmas was great. If you celebrate it, Hanukkah, Kwanzaa, whatever you decide you want to celebrate, I hope you had a good one. Uh, my Christmas was all right. I had to work it, but that's besides the point. Um, <laughs> before I go any further, make sure you guys are hitting that like button, subscribing to the channel, so you don't miss out on any of this content, and, and, and leave a comment in the comment section. Let's make a conversation about it. So in this video, I'm just going to go over, you know, things that happened this year. Well, right now, I'm technically recording this before 2024, uh, couple of days before so any anything i i tell you guys like uh, information and stuff like that that is based off of a couple of days before the end of the year but i don't have any more videos that i'm uploading for the begin uh, for this year that i'm in currently there's no other videos that i'm posting so this is what we're going with uh and so i'm gonna go over things that about 2023 and then we're going to talk about the future. So sit back, relax. I mean, honestly, if you got YouTube premium and stuff like that, just put this on the background. You can listen. Ain't nothing going to, you gonna, ain't going to see nothing. So, or at least perfect. Not this beautiful face. Um, but we're just going to talk. So just for future reference, I am going to try to do this every year. Uh, I've been more or less try to do it every year. Um, I believe last year I just did a end of the year update, which I think I just talked about what I was going to do in the future. So I just got my capture card, um, and everything, uh, to start be able to record things. So that, that was what I did. And I believe last, the year before, I'm pretty sure I've almost, almost every year I've done it an update video if either update video or i've done a update stream where i've done that so just for future reference that's what i'm going to be doing that every year i'm going to try to do an annual update so i'm going to go over a quick summary of all the games we've played this year uh well not games necessarily all the projects we've done this year um and so to start off, we started off with Brilliant Diamond Wedlock. Uh, we did not complete it. I lost interest. It, it, it was one of those things of I don't have much time out of the slotted time that I have to record to be able to do very much. I don't really need to play by Switch very often. That's why I like really like doing YouTube. It's because it's an excuse that I could play video games. Um, but yeah. So like. And oh, there was so much grinding. I'm hoping that if I do. You know. Brilliant Diamond and, and Shining Pearl. In the future. Uh, I won't have to do very much grinding. Hopefully. Fingers crossed. Then we did a Fire Red Leaf Green Soul Link with my son. Um, we only did like five episodes and we didn't get very far. We kept on losing. Um, but the reason why I stopped it is because we were, we just couldn't find the time. Like when, when he was behaving, we could not find the time because we were doing other things like going out, doing stuff. Um, and then. His behavior wasn't very great. So it just got to the point where I just said, you know what? I want to make sure that I have consistent content. Content that I know is going to be on the channel consistently until we finish the project. Um, and I just, I couldn't guarantee it. And it's not fair for me to have expectations for my son like that. Uh... Maybe in the future I'll be able to do something with him, but his behavior definitely needs to get better. Hopefully that 2024 he might. So and he might do some guest videos with me. I don't know. We'll see. Um so we played Bioshock 1, which I am proud to say we completed. 
Uh, out of all the games that I've ever done on my channel, this is probably my favorite, um, one of my favorites, I should say, um, that we completed. Also, not to mention, out of regular games, this was a first game I have ever completed on the channel. Now, I completed, te I technically completed Stranger Things, the mobile game, which I don't have it on here on this channel right now because of uh, I got scared of the Copa Act situation that happened a couple years ago. So I kind of like just, I purged my whole, all my content that uh, could have remotely been uh, that, which I found out later on I didn't have to do. Um, but I completed that. So technically, as far as your viewing pleasure, Bioshock is the first game that I ever completed with, you know, no problems, completed it all the way through. Then we have Bioshock 2, which I also completed, um... We wouldn't be doing Bioshock Infinite if we didn't complete 2. But we completed Bioshock 2, which technically, uh, I want to say this is my second game I completed of the year. It could have been this or it could have been uh, the next game. But Bioshock 2 was a game we completed. Um, just quick thing about the, game, the Bioshock 1 and 2. I love the series. That's why I'm, I, I'm doing the complete series. Because uh, I love the games, I love the franchise. I mean, I also like the company that makes it. Um, so, uh, no, no, no problem with that. So then we did uh, Pokemon Region Lock Kanto, which technically we completed uh, because technically right now the future project is a post game, um, which I feel like as far as pr project wise, that's a separate entity. Uh, but we beat the first uh, the first round of the Elite Four on Kanto, or in Fire, or Elite Green. So technically, we completed it. So that was the third game we beat this year. And then we we uh, we played WWE 2K23, my GM. Uh, we did one season, and we did I, I consider that a complete. We completed it. <clears throat> Granted, we didn't play multiple seasons. Uh, just ideally speaking, uh, I, I don't see myself playing it. I did get a lot of views on it. Uh, like, especially, uh, if I'm not mistaken, my Survivor Series PLE video. I'm pretty sure it's sitting over 350 videos. I think it was like 361 when I looked at it. <clears throat> but, and, and you know, so technically, you know, a lot of that did have the highest view count but this this channel is i i made it strictly to do games that i wanted to do i'm gonna be honest after a while after a while i kind of got bored with it but the only reason why i actually stuck through with it and completed it because i was like you know what i need to stop procrastinating if it's a game that i start i need to complete it or like a Nuzlocke challenge or whatever, like uh, like one, the the Bill at Brilliant Diamond. Instead of just, you know, just saying the heck with it, just barrel down, complete it, and just don't worry about the game anymore. Just never play it again. You know what I mean? Like, <clears throat> at least as far as for you guys' view viewing pleasure, that's what I should have done. Um, unfortunately, I I deleted the con the uh, file for BDSP. For the wedlock, so that's not going to happen, unfortunately. Um, I mean, I I had good mons. It was just again the grinding. The grinding was brutal. That's why I, I, I you know for future with a BDSP as far as the region lock, I'm gonna do. I'm gonna split it up. You know, do it with a brilliant diamond. To do it with shining pearl. Do it with with diamond version because those are the three games that I own personally. <clears throat> so I just want, you know, I don't want to lose interest. I love Pokemon. It's probably my favorite franchise of all time. I've been playing it since I was eight. I'm I'm 35 now. I've been playing it for a long time. Um, so yeah. Anyways, <laughs> going off my tangent, off my soapbox, 
Uh, so yeah, we did the WWE 2K23, my GM, we completed the first season, we won, which that was another, that also, that was another reason why I wasn't like dead set on doing a season two is because we already beat it. If we would have lost to SmackDown, or no, if we would have lost to Raw, then I would have done a season two, but we beat it. We beat them pretty easy. Uh, surprisingly enough, we beat them pretty easy on expert mode. Which I, I normally ever never win on an expert game. Um, so moving forward, uh, so we have region lock Johto, um, which is st- still currently going on, and I will give more details to that in a minute. Um, but we have Bioshock Infinite. We're still playing that game, um, which I believe, if I'm not mistaken, we're already halfway through. I, from what I've been told, and now I don't know this to be true necessarily, but I've been told that Bioshock Infinite is short is shorter of a game than Bioshock, or the first two Bioshocks. Um, so if that's the case, then we're probably about halfway done, almost done. Um, yeah, so then we have right now as far as projects, we have Region Lock. Uh, Canto post game, which that is also still co- currently going on. Which, uh, in a moment, I'm going to go over uh, what my game plan is as far as like the scheduling and what we're going to do with the content. So, overall, I, I think it's been a great year. Um, we beat four games, like I said, and which you know is more than I've ever done on this channel. So, I feel like that's that's something we can we can definitely be proud of. I'm definitely proud of it, and hopefully, you know, we'll do more. We'll we'll beat more in the year to come. Again, I have more content. Hopefully, uh, with what I'm about to do, hopefully we'll have even more to come out to you. But yeah. All right. So now we can talk about future of the channel. So, looking at, uh, looking at the current state of things, uh, I believe that I need a schedule. And I can't say that I'll completely follow it, because <laughs> looking at my past, I don't... It's not that I don't want to follow it, not that I don't try to follow it. It's just, it seems like every time I try to do a schedule... Something happens to where it just doesn't work out. Now, the schedule that I've thought of, I feel is more more inclined to be able to work. Hopefully for now. And uh, if we should start seeing more improvement on the channel, then I should be, I'll, I'll, I'll make the schedule bigger. Um... So moving forward, uh, Bioshock will and uh, we'll continue Bioshock Infinite, and we will doing be posting it and have it up ready for you guys on Tuesdays at eight a.m. in Eastern Standard Time. And I'm only doing one episode a week because I want to beat the game again. Like I told you guys in the, er, earlier, that you know. I just if I if I lose interest, which I haven't with this game, but just for future reference, I just need to barrel down and get it done. Um, Bioshock, it, it's not a huge project as far as considering to the other project what we do. Um, Bioshock will probably finish up rather soon, um, at least sooner than the other project. So yeah. Bioshock Infinite will be up on Tuesdays at 8 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, at least around it. Um, then the next project we have is Region Lock, Pokemon Region Lock, um, which uh, there's something to it. But we will post on Wednesdays and Thursdays at 8 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Now... Moving forward with the region lock, I think what I'm going to do as far as a formula of how it's going to come out, but also not overlap or mess up uh, per se. 
because I've already messed up a couple of times as far as uh, things that I've done. So I want to make sure that we we, we, we we try to dial it down a bit. So whenever we hit the like goal for post game, I think I'm going to stop or as, as long as if we're overlapping. So again, example, we're in we're playing our current project, which is Jodo. But we've hit the light like goal for Kanto. I think we'll stop Jodo, or so like you know if it's already past that point, we'll stop the the current project. So like I said, Jodo. Um, and every mon that we've caught up to that point, well at least for as far as post game, you know past previous post games, those will be locked in. Doesn't necessarily mean that they're going to be locked in, you know, moving forward once we get back into the current game, but uh, those mons will be locked. We can't catch them at all in the post game that we're playing. So, with Kanto, we're gonna move forward with playing just until we beat it. Post game Kanto, we're gonna play that. And every mount mon that I've ever caught, that I've caught in, in, caught in our first, our current attempt of Pokemon Johto, those will be locked, and those are not available. I also will have my own. I have my own set of personal rules as far as an encounter. Like for example, uh, there's going to be mons I want to use in the future games. If we run into them in like post game, um, I'm just going to say no. I'll just beat the can encounter the encounter and it'll just be a wasted encounter. Um, I have a certain ones uh, like a formula of what which I will go when I go more into that when I do the recording for post game, which will probably be you know is after me recording this. Um, but yeah, so right now we're gonna be doing Pokemon oh, Kanto post game. That will be Wednesdays and Thursdays, eight a.m. Eastern Standard Time. And then when we finish the post game for Kanto, we will go back to Johto. Now, say we go into Hoenn. Say that we haven't hit the light goal for Johto. Say we get halfway through Hoenn. Then we hit the light goal for Johto. I will stop Hoenn and play the post game for Johto until we complete it. And then we will jump back into Hoenn. Hopefully that explains everything. If it does not, I apologize. You'll just have to see it to believe it. Um, now, we will have a light goal, a certain light goal for the week, which I will probably have. I will, I'll announce it on Bioshock and just talk about it through, you know, throughout the, the week. That will be the light goal will be set for the likes of the week, not the likes of the, the video that you're currently hearing the light goal. It is going to be for that week. Now, if we hit the like goal for those three videos, I will post. I will post a video on that Friday, and that will be out at noon Eastern Standard Time. So it's something to look forward to. If if we don't hit the like goal, then that that post the video that was going to be on Friday will just be on the next week. <laughs> um, so, and that's how I'm going to do it as far as recording because. It, it suits what's going on in my current life. That's that is why I'm I'm doing the schedule. Also, with that with consideration, I also thought about this. After Bioshock Infinite is done, I am going to do strictly do Pokemon for right now until I decide that I I, I want to play something else. But honestly, I don't have another Pokemon. I don't, I don't have another game I want to play just yet. So. If we finish Bioshock Infinite soon, I will be just strictly doing Pokemon. And we'll just go from, you know, Tuesday to Thursday. It'll be, you know, instead of a Bioshock Infinite video, it'll be another Pokemon video. At least until we finish. And then when I decide to bring another game onto the channel, we'll do that. Also, Legends Arceus will be added to the, the mix of the region lock because I've had recently found out that uh, Nintendo announced that it is a can can canonic game. Um, 
So I will. It'll just be on the placement of things. It'll be after um, we do the Sino region. So the BDSP or Diamond version. Um, which what I'll do is I'm just not going to have a light goal for. Well, I won't have a light goal for it because I'm not going to do the post game for it because. I don't know. I guess if you guys if you guys like say you want it, maybe I'll do it. But for right now, I'm not doing post game for Legends RCS. But RCS will be added to the to the mix because it was supposed to be a game that would be unlocked if we got that like goal for like uh, for for Suno. But there's post game for Suno, so if we hit the like goal for that, that's what we'll do. So just moving forward. Any light goal we hit, it'll be strictly post game. And again, if you guys say something enough, I will do post game for Legends Arceus. It's just I already know that Legends Arceus will probably be the longest game that I'm going to be doing because I'm going to do it deathless, just like I'm doing everything else for Region Lock. I'm going to do it deathless. At least attempt to. We'll see how that goes. Um. And also, any update video, which I usually try to do quarterly update videos. Doesn't always happen, but I do try to do them. Um, those will be posted up on Mondays uh, at 8 a.m., I believe I wrote down. <laughs> Anyways, so to conclude everything, um, I think 2023 was a pretty good year. And I've seen more growth in the channel. And hopefully, it will get grow bigger You know, in the 2024 um, and I, you know, the one quote I, if I keep on thinking about whenever I do this, you got to spend money to make money. Not necessarily saying that I'm trying to, you know, make this, uh, make money off of this, but I do would like this to be my career instead of doing what I'm currently doing. Um, I like doing YouTube and I like, I like playing video games. So it, it just, he's one of those things if, if you, you know. The, the saying that I heard on Letter Kenny, if you like what you if you like what you do, you'll never you'll never work a day in your life. So that's why the way I see it. Um, so I'm actually gonna end it off here. I think I've taken up enough of your time. If you've actually made it to this point, if you made it to this point, I appreciate you. <laughs> this is 20 minutes of just me ranting and raving and talking about stuff. So if you made it this far, thank you. Um, and that's where I'm going to end it off here. Make sure you guys hit the like button, subscribe if you have not already to the channel. Also leave a comment in the comment section about anything I've talked about. Let's make a conversation about it. So that said, I've been your host, Scotty Pockets, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.